video is about Mother's Day and the things I did wrong with my mother. I never understood how, and it never just entered my mind that you only get one mother, you know? I think it's because I had over like a thousand relatives. It, it just did not sink in, oh, you just get one mother. Now think about that for a minute, because when that mother's gone, you don't have your best friend that you will ever have. Even if you get don't get along with your mother, it is the best friend you will ever have, because your mother will have your back. When I was going through the worst thing of my life, she was there. She couldn't help but monetarily, but she listened. She listened. So, this is what I wish I had done different with my mother. I wish I had spent more time with her. I was so involved with, you know, my, my life and my troubles. I never sat down with my mother and asked her, what are you dealing with? How can I help? And that's what everybody out there needs to do. Ask your mother, what can I do for you? Don't tell her what you want. You ask her, how can I help you? Uh, is something bothering you? You know, do you want to go to a nursing home? Or do you want to stay home? Are you having pain? Sit down and ask these questions to your mother. Because I guarantee you nobody else is going to do it. So it should be the children. So, that's the thing, when you get all caught up in your life and your problems, you forget that your mother or father needs you. I need my children. They're nowhere around. Nope, not around. They've never asked me, you know, how, how you doing, Mom? So... My daughter did send me about, I think, forty dollars. I I uh, needed it, so she said send me that now. So uh, about your mother, you should sit down and ask her questions on a video camera. Ask her what were the games that she played as a child. What was her experiences? Did she travel somewhere? All, and you should ask her all the places that she's lived. Because once your mother is gone, or your dad, you will not know this stuff. And if your, pa if your parents have been in the Army or the Navy, ask them about what it was like and what they did. This is very important information. And ask this is something my father, his mother put him on the front of the porch in the middle of winter because they thought he had pleurisy. I mean, you should look that up. Come to find out he didn't because back then they didn't, I guess it's like the COVID-19, they're separating the sick, but they put him on the front porch with no heat and he almost froze to death. Oh my God. But my grandmother on my daddy's side she I'm sure had some envy in her because she would make her own cough syrup with some herbs in the woods and she'd mix it like with honey I and mean, she was really old school so yeah ask ask your parents about did they ever get hurt as a child I know my daddy did tell me that he was in a creek and cut his toe with a broken bottle or something and you, you were never allowed to touch his toe huh. yeah you were never allowed because he would jump I guess it lost this nerve or something yeah these are the things you should ask your parents also ask them what it was like in school what did they eat in their lunchbox I know my mother told me that she would put her lunchbox in a, in a creek where it was cold water to keep the food from getting bad. So, yeah, spend more time with your parents. Don't wait until they're feeble and they can't walk. Do it now. Call 
your mother now. I wish I could call my mother and I 